Hello there, this is CJ Jarvis 777 and I'm bringing you today Unlimited Star Bottle Cap. Basically you need to come to Helios 1, which is here just above Nova, give some scrap yard. And you also need Scorpion Gulch, which is there by Hidden Valley, also not too far from Helios 1. That is where you're going to be able to get your um, Star Cap from. So we're in here as well, what we need to do is we need to wait 24 hours 3 times, that's 72 hours. See my maths there? Brilliant. So we need to do this 3 times. I will be posting more Fallout New Vegas videos, FIFA 11 videos, uh, Call of Duty videos, and Battlefield 2, Bad Company 2 videos. If any of you are interested in them, comment, like, and subscribe. Or just subscribe, but obviously don't comment, because this isn't a... Well, this is a Fallout New Vegas, you know. If you're interested in Fallout New Vegas, you don't want to comment. So we should do that twice more. It is boring. I understand that. But it is much quicker and much less boring than if you're going to travel the whole of the wasteland looking for the bottle caps yourself. I can promise you that. What would help is if you didn't have to go through all of this and that you could just skip from 24 to 1 very quickly, but you can't. So let's do this one more time. And remember, if you haven't got any, you need to do this 50 times and it is going to be incredibly boring, but you can do it. It's willpower. It's like Quitting smoking. Willpower. You need willpower to do it. You need willpower to do this. And you will have the willpower. Just think of all the beautiful stuff that's going to be in that headquarters. I'm not going to spoil anything. I'm not going to tell you what's in there. Just think about what's in there. It's going to be absolutely brilliant. Okay, now we need to travel. Oh, Jesus Christ. Now we need to travel to Scorpion Gulch. It's a very short travel time. I think it's something like 30 seconds until you actually get there from the loading screen. Some of the loading times on this game are absolutely ridiculous. I spent f four minutes on the loading time before in Freeside, I believe. It's absolutely ridiculous. Right. And there is your Wastelander right there. I'm not going to bother him first because he's not the, the real threat here. This, these scorpions are. Right, yeah, we'll uh, take this bitch out. Okay, so I suggest bring your followers. You can see now why I would suggest that. There is a fair few scorpions there. They are actually, he survived. I don't know how, but he actually survived. So now what you're going to have to do is you can pickpocket him. And then kill him, or you can just kill him and loot it off his body. Or you can just pickpocket him and leave him alone. But I, I didn't want to do that. And basically, you just do that over again. But I must stress, you must go back to Helios 1 and wait three, 324 hours or it will not work. You do this over and over again and I guarantee you within an hour, two hours you will have enough star bottle caps to get, you know, to get the stuff out of the Sus Sunset Susperate headquarters and I'll show you where that is on the map. It's right here across from the NCR Sharecropper Farms Yeah, basically that's that's where it is right there. And I have to stress as well, Vault 34, this vault is the worst vault in the game. I'm going to be posting this on all of my videos, no matter what they're about. As long as they're about Fallout New Vegas, I will tell you this. Vault 34 is the worst place in the game. The worst place in the game. If you don't have to go there, do not go there. I'm begging you. The only reason I would go there, or you would go there, is so that you can get the All-American, which is the gun I was just using, which is this gun here. A unique weapon in the armory there, but honestly, it's the worst place on earth. Do not go there unless you have to. I've been CJ Jarvis 777 Thanks for watching.